Hey guys, it's Braided Zero coming at you with a little wood tips and tricks video. I've been asked on stream a couple times what are a few recommendations I have for this game. So I figured I'd give you guys five tips that I have for any beginners to little wood. Let's jump right in. Tip number one, work on the reputation for your town folk immediately. Every single day, you have the option of complimenting one person. In addition, the first time you talk to somebody every day increases their liking of you. Use those wisely, and the first couple seasons, I recommend talking to every single NPC at least once a day and use your compliment on the person who either is lowest or maybe the one that suits your fancy that you want to romance eventually in the game. In addition to talking and romancing them or complimenting them, you can now, once they reach a certain level, take them with you every single day. And you have the option of taking somebody who is not at that certain level every few days. Between about three to seven days, you can take them with you. Unless you have some kind of a mission that you need to take a specific NPC with you, I recommend taking the one with you that you wish to romance or that you just wish to level up a little bit. Certain NPCs have blueprints that they will give you based on levels, so it's always a good idea to work on them. If you haven't received a blueprint from the character, raise them up. There's at least one blueprint each person's gonna give you. Tip number two, work on upgrading your structures immediately. I recommend working on about two to three at a time. So you'll wanna start with the forest and the cavern. The reason being is you get to increase your chances of finding tier two and tier three, which tier three is gonna be the most restrictive thing on your progress in the late game as eight, nine, and 10 of your stars requires a ton of those. The third one that I would recommend is the balloon, but only upgrade it to the port, move on. And then I would work on the two refineries, both your, your lumber and your stones. Tip number three, organize your city. Build the writing desk in every single home and find out what the people want. Organize your city based on their desires. Some people want to be within a certain number of spaces of buildings. Some people want to be a certain number of distance away from a building. I recommend putting the balloon in the marketplace in the middle, building the homes around them with their immediate shop next to them because they will typically want to be near their shop. Tip number four, work on your economy. You can sell stuff in the marketplace up to eight items every single day. Even if it's selling weeds or milk or butterflies or fish, whatever it is, sell at least eight things a day if you can. In addition, buy furniture that you find at the store. I recommend starting with at least buying every bed, table, chair, wallpaper, and carpet that you find. Those will be very important with upgrading your citizens' homes, which is just another great way of getting dew drops really early in the game. Tip number five, upgrade your tools as soon as possible. You can find the upgraded glove from Ash. One of the first conversations you have with him after him coming to your city, he will give you the silver glove. The upgraded net can be found within the casino in the first machine on the left. You have to gamble for it. The upgraded fishing pole can be found on the dock. It is blocked by a fisherman at first, but soon he will leave it and you can open the chest to get the upgraded fishing pole. The upgraded ax can be found behind the balloon once you go to the forest. The upgraded pickaxe can be found behind the entrance to the cave once you get to the cavern. Hey, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you like the content, please give the channel a follow and a like. I concentrate primarily on indie games on this channel. We like to check out new games that are coming to the scene. Also, if you'd like to come by our Twitch channel, I stream every Wednesday, 
Friday and Saturday from 8.30 p.m. CST to about midnight. Come by and say hi.